Hey guys, it's Brian with Bstride. So glad you're here. Today I'm going to talk about um, GE washer agitator removal and replacement. So this is it right here. Um, what you're going to want to do <clears throat> is sometimes clothes get stuck underneath or you might need to take this off um, to replace parts underneath it. So what I take here is just a screwdriver. Um, I just pry off the um, top fabric um, softener dispenser. Sometimes there's a screw holding this down. In this model, there's not. So I'm just going to pop that back on here. And we have the agitator here. Now what I do is I put my fingers underneath the base and I place my thumbs on top of it. Um, it's going to take a little bit of muscle here and you're going to want to pull up uh, on the actual lift. Um, base here. And I move my head away because when it pops, I don't want it to hit me in the face. It's never done that, but just in case. So, <clears throat> again, I just kind of pull up, and then you see it pop there. And at this point, you just go ahead and pull it up and bring it on out. I try to keep it at the same angle it is when I pull it out. I don't know if that makes a difference, but either way. Um, so at the bottom here, you can see if you need to clean anything or replace any of the splines here um, or re re replace that part, um, you can do that at this point. But in this model, you don't have to use a screwdriver or anything to um, pop it open, but I just kind of place it back down in the angle I got it out at, and you're going to want to just press it back down. And it, it should pop back in place, just like that. <clears throat> And I just kind of turn it to make sure it's it's going to turn with the tub when the tub turns. And so it can clean the clothes properly. All right, so go ahead and check out this next video, guys. It's going to tell you how to clean and remove the um, fabric softener dispenser. Um, please subscribe if this is helping you out and have a blessed day.